In the heart of the world lived a humble teacher with an extraordinary vision. A vision of a trillion dollar enterprise, a church of compassion, where all offerings returned to the people who made it. A church where riches were measured not in gold or silver, but in kindness and care. He took an oath to never keep a dime for himself, an oath to drive an old Miata, to live modestly, to stand as a beacon against the materialistic pursuit of the world. This was a man who wanted a world so self-sufficient, so full of love and generosity, that it wouldn't need a governing body. He wanted the church to be the ultimate refuge for the suffering, the struggling and the weak. This humble teacher would live in poverty, echoing the spirit of his brother Yeshua, who also never coveted personal riches, but dedicated his life to the service of others. Guided by Yeshua's teachings and the Lord's benevolence, he embarked on a journey to create a world that was as long on compassion as it was short on need. A divine mission, he described it, one that was less about individual wealth and more towards universal well-being. He envisioned a church, a trillion-dollar entity, that serves as the lifeblood of society, sourced by the faithful and returned in full to those in need. Patterned after Yeshua, the selfless historical figure who never kept a dime for himself, this teacher sought to become a beacon of hope for the weak and the forgotten. He challenged the concept of wealth, proving that one could hold considerable power without trapping oneself in the blinding glitter of jewels. With resolute faith, he walked this path, fueled solely by spiritual guidance. It was his heart that echoed in his prayers. He visualized an earth where we don't rely on a government, but a charitable institution that supports the struggling, the lost, the weak, channeling all resources for the greater good. He would be the poorest teacher, yet the richest in spirit, carving out a legacy of compassion like his brother Yeshua, such was his love for humanity, a manifestation of his undying love for the Lord. This is the heartwarming tale of a man who, cradled by divine influence, sought out to redefine the norm, making the world a tad bit more benevolent each day. A humble shepherd, a man of simple tastes and extraordinary devotion, who is about to embark on a journey. A journey that he believes is inspired by the divine, a mission to change human lives and to redefine the concept of giving. The shepherd achieves a slight profile, adorning no flamboyant attire or jewellery that could distract him from his purpose. Each cent from his church's wealth, amounting to an astounding trillion dollars, is pledged to be spent exclusively for the people, those in need, those suffering, those struggling. His mission is a colossal one, it is a vision to create a society where the church and its selfless generosity is all that people need, a utopia of sorts, where the need for a government is obsolete. Leaving no chance for greed, the shepherd himself, despite being the guide and leader of this monumental movement, promises to be its most impoverished member. Living in simplicity, his life mirrors the teachings of Yeshua, his spiritual brother. The story of the selfless shepherd is a call to us, a reminder of the immense power of selflessness, love, and the ability to nurture vision and realize it for the greater good.